Good morning. I'm at a TA in California, uh, Wheeler Ridge, just past uh, Grapevine. Uh, I, I got here yesterday evening. I'm just waiting for my clock to reset. After, uh, we could drive 11 hours in a day. I had about an hour left to drive, but it was, it was already getting too dark, too dry with the, with the oversized load for, for me. So, so uh, stopped at this TA, we're safe. Uh, I'm doing a pre-trip. And so when, when you do a pre-trip, you, you wanna check, uh, you, you wanna do a walk around your, your truck. You wanna, you wanna check your, your fluids, you wanna check your oil. You want to make sure all all caps are on where they're supposed to be. You want to check your steering linkage, make sure it's good, and uh, you know, you grab a hold of it, give it a little tug, and then make sure it's nice, nice, nice and tight. There's nothing loose or, or coming off. You want to check on the inside of your tires and uh, look, look at your brake pads. You, you want to check your brake pads. You want to make sure your brake pads are are good. You want to check for for any wiring that. Uh, that may be torn or or coming apart. You want to check your 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 belts and your and your hoses. And uh, when you have the hood up, you, you can take a good good look at your 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 steer tires. I drive for a company. These are not my trucks. Uh, I drive because th this is this is my job. And another big part of my job is is uh, being responsible for the truck. And if I take care of the truck, and I treat it like it's mine, the truck will take care of me, and uh, and your employer will will appreciate that, definitely. the the truck The truck I'm driving now is a 2018 Mack Pinnacle. I was driving a uh, another truck, really nice truck. It was a it was a W990 Kenworth. It's a, that, that one was a 2022, I mean, super awesome truck. It's a little longer than, than this truck. It has a longer nose. You know, it's got that, that old school uh, look, re really pretty. But uh, so I was driving that truck for about nine months and then, then uh, I tore my ACL, so I was out for a time. And then when I came back, they had another driver in the truck and, and all that. And just to make an easy transition back, I just took it upon myself uh, to, to take this truck here and take care of the, this truck, even though it's a little older, and uh, I had a choice, pretty much had a choice of what truck I wanted to be in, but I wanted to, I wanted to drive uh, s something different. That's the luxury uh, I, I have at, at this company. We we, we have a uh, different model trucks, so, so so that's nice. And and I find that uh, I, I uh, one one another driver said, uh, "Royal, you, you shouldn't be saying stuff like that because you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna get yourself in trouble with other drivers." But I find the Mac handles better than the Kenworth. I mean, uh, every truck has its its uh, pros and cons, but I'm really enjoying this, this truck here, and it's, it's a beautiful experience. So I have the hood lifted uh, on, the, on a Mack truck and many other trucks when you lift the hood. So I've, I've, done, a, I've, I've done a quick check of, of everything here. You know, I'm, I walk around the truck in, in the morning, I check everything out, make sure I have all my signs and flags, and when, when I come around this side, you know, then I can See my fluid reservoir here for my uh, radiator fluid. I've got a reservoir for my wiper washer fluid, and uh, you know, and again, I can check the belts on this side, hoses, things of that nature. Again, you want to check your your, your brakes and all that. I've got my pilot car driver good pulling morning, up. Sir. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Just about ready to roll out. That's awesome. Yeah. Good deal. Good deal. All right. All right. I'm almost done right here. Okay. All right. Yes. Yeah, well, one of my pilot car drivers. So in California, I actually have two pilot car drivers. I have one in the front and one in the back. Um, this morning, I clean, clean my windshield, clean, clean my windows, clean my mirrors, and um, I like using Rain-X. Ooh, I love this stuff. It's re really, really awesome. Uh, I put it on, on my windows. I put it on my mirrors. And, and b believe me, it's 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 a big help when it starts raining. I mean, we're we're we're, we're drivers, and as drivers, uh, you know you're gonna experience when you're when you're coming out west, you'll experience 
sometimes dust storms, high winds. Uh, I mean, depending on the season, you may get some uh, some uh, hail, sleet, and and of course, uh, of course, rain. And rain next, I find really, 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 really helps. I mean, the the water just beads, runs off the the windshield. Uh, many times you don't have to use your wipers because it's working so well. And uh, and then. Uh, when you do have to use your wipers, that's because it's raining really, really heavy. But I mean, Rainix is is awesome. I recommend it to 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 everybody. But I just wanted to do, a, you know, show everyone a quick walk around. Oh, what I did want to show you, I got distracted with the pilot car driver. Okay, so when you lift the hood on the Mack truck, and there's other trucks. Before you lower the hood, and a lot of people may have run into this when they first come come up to a new truck. They they you got to flip this little lever here. And that's going to release the, the the hood, and you're going to be able to lower that. You're, you're going to be able to lower the hood with with no problem. If not, you're going to be pushing on the hood. You think it's stuck, and if, if you don't know, sometimes you just don't know. And uh, but if you don't know, ask, ask. Uh, you know, so that's just a little bit of information. Hope everybody enjoys the day. Hey, uh, if 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 you watch this video and if 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 you're not a friend or family member, because those those, those are the easiest to get a like a like and a subscribe from, you know, uh, like subscribe. If you have a, a a question or comment, feel free to leave it in, in the in the messages. And uh, if you're a truck driver, uh, you have some tips, some pointers. Uh, I've been driving six years, but as a as a truck driver, and every other truck driver knows we're constantly learning. There's always something new that we can pick up. Uh, some uh, so, so yeah, just uh, just like, subscribe, you know, and, and if you're a truck driver, have, have fun, have fun at, at what you're doing. Um, my, uh, my fiance uh, asked me if I talked to my truck, I said, yeah, I talked to my truck, I, I love my truck, I give my truck a big hug, you know, blow kisses, all that, all that good stuff, my truck takes care of me, I mean, Helps me pay the bills, keeps me safe while I'm out on the road. So in turn, I want to take care of my truck. Uh, but yeah, so everybody in, enjoy the day. Be friendly, kind to someone, and just stay positive.